Alright, let's talk Hollow Knight, Silksong, and the delays that have been driving fans crazy. If you're like me, you've been waiting what feels like forever for this game. So, is the delay a disaster, or could it actually be a blessing in disguise? Let's dive into it. First off, let's address the frustration. Delays are always tough, especially when you've got a game like Silk Song that's been hyped for years. Team Cherry, the developers, have been pretty quiet about the whole situation, and that silence only adds to the mystery and impatience. But here's the thing when a game gets delayed, it's usually because the developers want to perfect it. And let's be real, we'd rather wait for an incredible game than get a rushed, buggy mess. Just look at how Cyberpunk 2077 went down. Nobody wants another situation like that. So what could the extra time actually mean for Silksong? Well, one thing that's clear is Team Cherry is obsessed with quality. The original Hollow Knight wasn't just a hit because of its tight gameplay, it was a masterpiece of art, music, and design. That same attention to detail is likely going into Silk Song, and if they're taking their time, it's probably because they want to deliver a sequel that lives up to, or even surpasses, the original. One of the big things fans are speculating is that this extra time is allowing them to add more content. Maybe they're refining the boss battles, tweaking the combat system, or even adding whole new areas. Every extra month means more polish, and more polish means an even richer, more satisfying experience for players. Imagine the world of Silk Song being even more expansive, more challenging, and more immersive than what we initially expected. Sounds worth the wait, right? Then there's the technical side. Hollow Knight had its share of bugs at launch, but Team Cherry worked quickly to fix them. With Silk Song, they could be taking extra time to ensure that the game launches smoothly, minimizing any post-release issues. This would make for a much better experience for us from day one. And let's not forget about expectations. Silk Song has an insane level of hype around it, which can be a double-edged sword. The delay could give Team Cherry the breathing room they need to not just meet those expectations, but exceed them. A rushed release could kill the momentum, but a polished, refined game? That could cement Silk Song as one of the greatest indie games of all time. So, is the delay frustrating? Absolutely, but when we finally get our hands on Silk Song, I'm betting it's going to be worth every second of that wait. Sometimes delays aren't setbacks, they're setups for something truly amazing. What do you think? Is this delay killing the hype for you, or do you think Silk Song is going to come out better because of it? Let me know in the comments. And if you want more updates on Silk Song and all things gaming, hit that subscribe button and stay tuned for more. Thanks for watching and I'll catch you in the next one.